Hey folks, AWR Hawkins, Breitbart News. I want to talk to you real quick about the fact that murder is still surging in Democrat-controlled cities. We covered it at Breitbart on Monday of this week in Atlanta, in Denver, in Houston, in St. Louis, murders through the roof. Not only that, if you look at cities like Los Angeles, cities like Boston, murders going up, up, up. Not only that, but you know we regularly cover at Breitbart. Chicago and New York City, they become shooting galleries. Over the weekend in Chicago, nearly 60 people were shot. Three were killed. In New York City, 34 people were shot. Ten were killed. Seven of those deaths occurred on Sunday alone. One of those deaths was a 16-year-old boy who got shot in the head. Now, Mayor de Blasio toward, told New York City residents he's... You know, he laments the boy's death, and but we've gone through this before. Just a few weeks ago, he was lamenting the death of a one-year-old who was shot and killed in a stroller. You see the point? Nothing is changing. These Democrat-controlled cities are killing fields, all right? Now, you'll remember that article Washington Post did. We covered it at Breitbart. They said, of the top 20 most violent cities in America, 17 of them have a Democrat mayor. Of the top 20 cities with the most incidents of violent crime per 10,000 residents, 19 of 20 have a Democrat mayor. Folks, this is why President Trump says Democrat-run cities are dangerous. Some of the most dangerous places you can be. He's right. Folks, wherever you live, learn your state law. Do what you have to do legally to exercise your Second Amendment. You keep a gun with you for self-defense.